888 Shade 45, Street Sweeper Radio, DJ K Slate, Drama King of the Building, <laughs> Ashley Ray in the Building. We got another special guest that's walked in the building. We got the legendary Gangsta Boo hey. in the motherfucking hey. South. Y'all might do this. Is some of they left? Is this which way it's supposed to go? Ooh, this yeah, way? You be easy oh, the way you grab oh, that yeah, mic, please. Be, be <laughs> Just be careful how you grab it's the dirty, mic. It's dirty minds in this. Dirty it's, sound, it's, dirty it's, sound. It's, nah, it's hypnotized <laughs> minds in here. Be oh, easy, easy so how funny. you grabbing that mic. Word What's up? up, man? What's going on, Gangsta Boo? Nothing. It's good to see you, man. Good to see you too, homegirl. Of course. Trill, you always like y'all. a fucking like like real light. Every time I see you for the last, not even like since 2013. Every time you're like just good energy and vibes yeah, and it's, working it's and zen, getting zen. it. The zen. I'm the about zen. to start some crazy energy. Not crazy energy. What? But real energy. Yeah, we. How, what, <laughs> what? No, no, this real energy. No, what what year was you first a part of 3 Six Mafia? Year? What year? Oh, yeah, uh, like year? 1994. So we say 1994. It's safe to say that you could be considered Queen of the South. I'm not, Legit. I'm not bugging, you know no, no, hold up, hold up. I'm not, I'm not, I'm just saying, because I, I was thinking about that shit yesterday. I was like, wait a minute. I'm... Gangsta Boo was around, you know, Early. <laughs> okay, I know you get to talk your shit on the New York shit, but I'm from the South. Like, I grew up, like, 3-6 Mafia, fucking the screw tapes, all that shit in high school, junior high school, all that. Like, for, as far as we consider, like, this is what we heard for, fem for female rap. You want like, to to like for real. Though, I don't really, I don't like, I don't really, took, I, I mean, I, just the I, queen talks, oh, I don't know. I'm kind of burnt out Nikki on us. us. I Nick, you can't no, put no, words no. in my mouth. No. That's dead. Yeah, what I'm saying, he asked the question, so the answer, mm -hmm. I don't consider myself the queen of the South. I consider myself Lola. Like, now, back in the day, yeah, I used to, you know what I'm saying? Because it was, like, so cool, but now it's just, like, so burnt out. It's just kind of like calling everybody your friend. I just wow, rap. Yeah. I'm gangsta boo. I'm a legend, and I just kind of, like, leave it like that. I'm not queen of this, queen of that. Like, I'm just a natural-born queen in a way, just from, you know. Hey. You wearing your motherfucking hair like a queen. Yeah, you okay. know what I'm saying? You took it back to the roots. <laughs> Fuck Crown that. Popping. I'm a here, K yeah. Slate Drama King said Gangsta <laughs> Boo is the queen of the South. If you come with somebody oh. before 1994 from down there and you want to challenge what I said, then challenge it. Come through. That's come what through. I'm saying. You know I them ain't, titles, man. Ain't no disrespect to nobody else, but you got to pay homage to who laid the platform Absolutely. and who was there. <laughs> and I it. know who I was I, like rocking I, I out to. I appreciate that. I like, appreciate that. It was you. Okay. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. So now, look. We got some music, right? Yeah, we do. Time um, ticket. Let's jump into some yeah, of these fly yeah. this, records this, we got. This, uh, this some new stuff. Act, this ain't never been played. I'm, this is brand new. This have a project I'm working on with my boy B King. Um, it's coming. It's called Underground Cassette Tape Music Part Two. It's dropping September 14th. Oh. But this is all exclusive, like literally. Exclusive world premiere. So worth it. Drop that right now. Hey. Shade four five. Eight today, Shade four five. Street Super Radio. DJ K Slate. Drama King in the building. Ashley Ray in the building yeah, and the yeah, queen yeah, of the yeah, South yeah. is in the building. Oh, Lord, you hey. Gangsta hey. Boo oh, is Lord. in the motherfucking building. <laughs> 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 throw your <laughs> braids in the air. Throw your motherfucking <laughs> braids in the air. Not to throw Word my braids up. in the air. Throw your <laughs> braids in the motherfucking air. <laughs> oh, man, that's so funny, dude. Yeah, I'm, I'm here, man. I'm here. I hit you up. Thank you for inviting me because I can actually come to New York to do a show. I got a, well, yeah, I got a show Friday mm -hmm. at Where's Sony that? Hall. Where? And so yeah, it's a, a Sony Hall is a new spot, so I heard, but it's with Ghetto Gothic, my girl Venus. Okay. Yeah, so I'm out here for that. It's Friday, you know what I'm saying? Sony Hall. So y'all out here and y'all hear me, you know what I'm saying? Come through, get your tickets, Sonyhall.com. And you gotta stop with the DM shit. Yeah. I'm a fucking like. But I, I, I could, text you could, though. I text no, you a no, couple I looked times. After, because I looked in my, I just happened to look through my calls. DM. I'm hard. I said, oh shit. But I text There's you a the couple times. Out. Then then I look back. I got two phones. Oh, okay, That's I got the, I got like the artist type, the groupie type, Google Voice type number or something. Right, no, the Google it ain't Voice that. Number you you got the, the number that means you knew me a long time. <laughs> <laughs> you understand? <laughs> See how I flipped that shit? Uh, you uh, flipped uh, that. You flipped that. I looked and I said, "Oh shit, gangsta boo!" No, we got to squeeze uh, out. Uh, I need, I need, Somehow. I need that VIP. I need that that contact that Diddy got. No. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But um, these thank records you, that you are putting out right now, where did they they? Off a project coming soon? Yeah, through. it's with me and my boy B King, and it's called Underground Cassette Tape Music Part Two. We did a part one before, mm -hmm. and it, it it took it, it got a lot of good press, and but we were just doing it as a mixtape. But this one, we gonna put out on our own, independent, but online. You know how it is nowadays, child. But anyway, it's fun, and I'm glad I collaborated with him. He from Houston, and he popping and shit like that. Big Trill, I think you know who B King is. Yeah, no, so, he don't. He's lying. But um, shit. yeah, so that you was don't the first know nothing time about real music. that has been played, and so yeah. So we so, had yeah, exclusive. Yeah, you really do. Like, I don't even know if they sound good or not. But I like those. 
Yeah, so it was kind of like last minute. I hit you up, told you I was in the city, didn't expect to come up here, but I'm here, so Rush had to right play through. some because I knew you were going to ask for music, so you know how that's I do. why it's new. But it's I, cool because yeah. it's new and it's exclusive, so yeah, exactly. And what better way to play it than a legend? Do a legend, right here, legend, yeah. legend, the legend, word. Yeah. So look, um, we got another joint. What's the next joint we're gonna get? I into? don't know what. Gotta Do is pretty good And the one after that one I shot a video for in Houston Slim Thug came through Pow Wow Like all the Houston legends Kiki Zero Bun B Bun B on the album too So That's the, Shout out to oh. all my Houston boys Man them boys Some Texas boys Yeah They kinda like You could blend right in with, In Houston Like you got like a Not a You definitely got a New York vibe But just the persona The the boss hog type shit You know what I'm saying So shout out to my Houston boys But Gotta Do is a lit one too Let's drop that Shade 45 8 today Shade 45 Street Sweeper Radio G J.K. Slade, Drama King in the building. Yes. Ashley Ray in the building. Hey. The Queen of the South is in the building. <laughs> hey. This man just throwing the title yep. over here. Yep. Oh, exactly. uh, can I ask you a question? Please, please, please. Um, you're from Memphis? Born and raised. Born and can raised. you tell me what female MC was rocking before 94? Uh, I can't like in the that, South. but in the, uh, Mia in X. the South. I would have Mia to say X. Mia X. Okay, you know what? And Got I said Mia, that. But no, but I remember, I remember Mia X like, Around ninety six seven, mm -hmm. that's when uh, they was really yeah ninety three. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, know that, what? That was probably okay. for people start like the New Yorkers weren't really it fucking was. with the stuff yeah. back then. So she probably me has been bubbling for so long because she then she got like ten years on me as far as age wise. I got, somebody I in got the ice cream man and, and all that shit. Her. Like no, I, I'm, so I'm, Mia X, you, you now you feel me? That nigga, <laughs> Mama Mia baby. What, what that nigga? I, what that nigga? Uh, uh, Master P, Miss Ice Cream Man. Uh, uh, ice cream. Remember, man. I really miss my. my Home is. Yo, that shit oh, right no, there. No, 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 that hey. shit right <laughs> there. I still listen to Masterpiece's greatest hits uh, to this day. Uh, uh, yeah. Yo, that, yo, that record. <laughs> that's what really, my man used to, he was about, they used to drive me, used to listen. I'm like, man, who the fuck is that? that you understand? Master P. School. Master P, what? I heard that shit right there. I was like, yo, give me that CD, baby. Yeah, yeah Master P. You understand? So. Like, yeah, okay. Me and Mia X, like around that time, Mia I was Mia X say. was, okay. Mm -hmm. she was, she and was then around. she was the only female in the, the a, a, a male, a clique, a male group, well, you know, a collective, because they didn't, they weren't a group. I was actually in a group. Mm -hmm. No Limit was more of a collective, but she still was beasting with all the boys, you know. I would say, shit, as so. a Southern girl listening to rap, it was Mia, and then it was you, and yeah. then Shauna came afterwards. Shauna like, from Chicago. From Chicago. You don't, don't even know, know your reason. No, Chicago no, but she came Chicago. in on the ATL sound. Stop no, it. I don't care. You she came nah. in on that no, 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 get the no, no, fuck no, out of here. Did. She did. She's nice. No, she did. She spits, but you cannot. I don't care. You cannot. She came in on their beats, rapping like them. I don't care. No, Shauna, Shauna was like these artists. These hold on, you're not down, like, down south. Shauna was. I can't say that because first of all, that's my girl. So, I, like, I give credit to where it's due. She had the the, the twister flow for anything. That's Chicago shit. Oh yes. The bread, like rapping fast. Like I can't say Shauna came in on some. Actually, we were signed together on Relativity. She used to be in a group. I forgot that it was another chick with her too. I forgot the name of the group Shauna used to be in. But now nah, Shauna didn't come in rapping like. She Yo, from the when south. we called Ashley, her down south in high school, Ashley, I'm that sorry. Was the I don't care. I'm telling you, if you're confused with somebody from that's your. <laughs> Business. I'm but you can't you put somebody experience. in another region and put no, you can't do it. It's not fair. It's just nah, like it ain't fair. it's just like uh it's chicks that uh are from New York that should that, rap like they're from New York. No, that represent and do radio and everything this and that and the third. And you're from Arkansas and you're doing radio for somebody to say, well, from day one, who was one of the greatest from New York? From Arkansas? We'd have to say we can't say <laughs> well. You if you migrated, me, <laughs> you <laughs> migrated here, but New York it might be an argument. You understand what I'm saying? <laughs> like, so this is what I'm saying. Come on, stop. stop. But see, that's another thing. I'm not anyway, from Arkansas, but you wouldn't class anyway, classify me as Arkansas radio. Anyway, anyway, <laughs> exactly. Anyway, you know what me I'm and the X was the southern. That's it right yeah, there. Okay. That era from back then. And shouts to her because I definitely heard her on on them joints. So yeah, I, you that's, can't that's forget about girl. her. Yeah, you know now she's legendary. She's still doing her thing too. Very legendary. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, um, you want to shout anything out? Any projects? Uh, anything? The underground cassette tape music, man. That's what I'm. That's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. Shout out to my boy B King and pretty much the whole the, everybody that's listening right now. If you, most importantly, man, the legend. Everybody up in this motherfucker. If y'all here, come to Sony Hall Friday. I'll be in that junk with Ghetto Gothic, my girl Venus. And guess who I met? I was in L. A. Kanye West had a private. Uh, party and I actually met him. I don't know if y'all met him, but he was actually cool. If he I don't smile him. on photos, but he was smiling and laughing. Outside of he said, I don't know if I met Kanye, 
When I met sure Kanye, because I like talking like real conversation with jaw, you, like back his jaw was still swollen. You shouldn't have said that. Of course you. No, I'm keeping it a million. And he was like, <laughs> he wanted me to listen humble. to his album, his first album, to help him pick the single, which I told him the Jamie Fox and Twisted joint was definitely it. Yeah, yeah. And um, <laughs> he was with Consequence, and I You're picked the cool single, head. and um. <laughs> Yeah, he did that a free, was a, he did two free out, two moment. free beats from my album. You understand? And I brought him to do his first as an artist interview on Hot and let him freestyle. And I put Graph on him to see if he could. You understand? I'm saying I put Graph. Where would that go? Yeah. The toe to toe with Graph and yeah, Kanye. Yeah, toe to toe with Graph and and he spit a lot of rhymes, which I did hear a lot of them later on on his album. Oh, but still, <laughs> he spit and he he stood to a consequence was up there as well. And that's how me and Kanye. That was went. a blonde moment for me too. Like, mm -hmm. I, that, of course you met Kanye. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, come on, how you gonna hit me that like that? Blonde, that but, was a blonde moment. But, but the <laughs> craziest thing about it is, and I can't wait till I see him because I ain't seen him in a long time. Last, the time I seen him after that was 2008, and I was in Vegas, and he came walking in with his entourage, <laughs> and I'm standing on the pillar. I'm in the Mandalay this Bay, stage. like this, and he walks in, he looks at me, and keeps walking, and he stopped and ran back and said, oh, I can't walk by you like that. Mm. You know what I'm saying? He said, but you good? I said, yeah, I'm good. And then he did the, uh, what's that shit, wait till I get my money. Yeah. Like, he did he, the remix, ooh, and that's with Jeezy, and that's what the end, he was like, and after all of the drama, I case slayed him. Like, he threw my name up in there. Yeah. Like, okay. Yeah, Deuces. Yeah. But... The only <laughs> failure with that is I said to him, yo, whatever you do, bro, don't change. He was humble, cool he in the listen. studio case. <laughs> and, and I don't that, know that, who that the was, fuck that nigga is. Well, right no, now. That, that first he yo. came out to that song and it was a super small state. Like literally, I was like, damn. Thank, I was thankful. I was like, wow, you know, it's, it's still some hope. But I said all that to say, like, life been good for me. I've been surrounding myself around some really dope circles. So I'm excited to be here to perform Friday. And for this new project I'm working on, by the way, shout out to my DJ, Nick Hook. He toured Nick, with what me. What up, what up, man? Come on, Mike, right quick. Come he on, come on, with, Mike, Yeah, he on. was on tour with me, DJ, for me, with Jones. He's a producer as well. Yeah, he yeah, what produced with LP and what some do, more shit. Does. So okay. he's, um, DJ, he, you know. It's an yeah. honor to be here. Right, shout out to the guy. He never been here before at all. Not even serious no but he was super stoked to meet you where so. you from nick i'm originally from st louis but i've been here for like 15 years <laughs> okay all right you here yeah, yeah i live here yeah, okay yeah, yeah. that's what's up yeah super dope point. Point. That, all right that's, that's, the, that's the video come, area come through the studio that's where they do videos yeah, at greenport and okay. i need to be on your project uh, anytime you need me you know you got me oh you know so, i got you and you know um, i got yeah, you that's my boy nick hook we toured together with runner jewels and he's djing my set so yeah shout out to him and now uh, we're working on new music as well. We everybody working. Look at my girl Wendy. <laughs> no, y'all didn't give a hip up. This is my like, jeweler. Okay, I don't this, mind. Is, this is the jeweler of the squad. So yeah, I got my little New York click right here with me. Well, you're a jeweler? Yeah, yeah. she that well. I'm a jeweler. I can't to afford the all that shit right now, but yeah, this <laughs> it, it, it might look kind of lightweight, but this some the shit some bitches be wearing at the Oscars where it looked like it's like ten dollars, but this shit like fucking ten thousand dollars and shit. That's a that's a rave review. Ten dollar looking stuff. <laughs> so it's like yeah. WendyBrandis.com, GangstaWoo.com. And y'all, man, I just appreciate the love. And this new song we about to get into, this another exclusive. So three exclusives for the legend, K Slay. Hold on, did you shout group. out? Did she say something? Who's that? Wendy Brandis. Yeah, you on your phone, man. You on your phone on Pornhub and shit. You on Pornhub. Yeah, you know I don't fuck with Pornhub. I do the real thing. You know me, I don't do that. Uh, Too many of them uh, around me. <laughs> So yeah, Wendy, you want to try to give, give, give let, let them know where you can get your jewelry from, right quick? Yeah, WendyBrandis.com. <laughs> Okay. That's where you, that's where you get the all stuff. The, all of her stuff ten thousand yeah, dollars. <laughs> okay. But um, this record that we planned, my verse is first, just for everybody that um want to know, it's it's screwed though. Like I said, this, I work with a Houston producer, so I'm just really stoked. And when I pulled up to Houston, Slim Thug, Bumby, Powell, fucking just all the Houston legends came out, and I can't even pull that off in Memphis, my own damn city. God and them don't, you know, no shame. I'm, I'm just saying, I can't even pull that out. So it it made me it hum. It was very humble and I it, you know it's motivating to 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 still know like you was a pretty queen and stuff queen and stuff you know I take it sometimes okay I take it tonight because that did make me feel really good like I got all these boss hogs 
look flip pulled up in the wraith like niggas pulled up so there was some queen shit cause bitches that's from Houston that's rapping can't even get all them niggas to pull up and B-King has something to do with it too but at the same time I'm sure if it wasn't with Gangsta Boo B-King if you listen they wouldn't have pulled up but the video the video is gonna be sick and I can't wait for y'all to see it it's coming out and our project will be out sometime September there you go so yeah drop that joy torch thanks for coming through Gangsta I love you thank you so much